Hi guys, today we're going to do a AND query and I'll show you what I mean by that. We're still using the same database with the same two tables we created in the previous videos except here we're going to just uh, select one of these tables customer financials and maybe we're interested in looking at people whose salaries are customers whose salaries are greater than say 40,000 and also uh, that are f female okay so both of these things we want them to be true so we we don't want to see males and we don't want to see people whose salary is less than 40,000 so how do we do this okay so using this table we're going to go to create query in design and here we're going to add only the custo customer financials table Okay, so having added this table, let's say we're interested in the last name of the customer, the date of birth, the salary, and whether they're male or female. Okay, added one extra by accident. Okay, so and what what like we said, we want to we're only interested in, in those customers whose salary is greater than forty thousand. So under after we've double clicked the fields that we're interested in in the order we're interested they pop up down here okay and on the row of criteria under salary we're gonna type greater than sign 40,000 and you don't have to put any commas to complicate the situation just make sure you put the right amount of zeros and the greater sign before so this is only going to show if I run this query over here with exclamation on the top right it's only showing the customers in my customer financials table that have greater than forty thousand dollars salary as you can see from this column right here right no one's here that's less than forty thousand right but we want to add one extra thing so we go back to design view we also want to make sure that they are female so under female we can type yes let's see if that'll work and see we are only getting those who are who have more than forty thousand salary and are female keyword is and okay so going back to data sheet view let's see what we did we wrote both these conditions on the same row this is very important when you want to do an AND query, that is that both uh, conditions are satisfied, you have to write the conditions in on the same row. Okay, this is important. So, and yes over here, remember that the female column was a yes or no column. We checked uh, a box if the uh, record or the row was a female and we left it unchecked if it was male so by writing yes here we're saying show me only the checked col uh, records and those that are uh, that make more than forty thousand and when we run it with the exclamation uh, symbol we get uh, the females who make more than forty thousand then we can close this query and when we close it it'll ask us to save we'll say yes and we'll call this females greater 40k okay we get the idea and when we hit OK it'll close it and you see it pops up over here we can double click and see the results okay so that's how you do an AND query using one table it's sort of like doing a filter on this original table okay so the next video I'm going to do an OR query using the almost the exact same uh, criteria. Okay, So be sure to watch that because that will make it really clear the difference between an AND and an OR and you'll learn both at the same time. Okay, So make sure you subscribe, comment if you have any questions and make sure to practice. Have a great day.